this this was Jason's shit. That was the fucking bandana and the other shirt. Get all kinds of shit. Here, go ahead. Go. There's no point opening it while we're doing the podcast. If you're not no, 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 no. That fucking noise and the microphone and shit. Did you read? You know what from? this is? Oh it's from gosh. Barkley. What? It's from who? Is that a good head shake or a yeah. bad head shake? Holy shit. Can you open the shit properly, Leonard? What the fuck? Another camera? Holy shit. So we have no excuse. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> There's no excuse not to film, Leonard. Let me see. Isn't that the same one you're holding? Uh, similar, but no. Very similar. I think there's other stuff in it. Okay, well, open the fuck yeah, This is actually... Watch out for the popcorn, bro. This isn't the post office floor. Shut your mouth. You're probably this swimming in this stuff at work. This would be perfect for Jason. Is there a note in here? Whoa! This looks like something Brad would like. Is it a bottle of whiskey? Why are you turning your back to me? Really, Lenny? You make... At least you don't have glass on the floor like somebody I'm not gonna whose names I won't mention leaving window glass from their car. Oh. Okay. Oh I wasn't far off. What is it? Rye whiskey. Yeah. Templeton Rye. Look there at this. Go. That's right. That's mine. Look at Brad's Thank eyes you. light up. Thank you. <laughs> well, Thank thanks you, Barclay. a lot. Barkley. Lenny won't drink it, you're a pussy. Barkley from I You're not even giving anybody the opportunity to drink it, Brad. Charles or Saquon? Right. We'll take, we'll take Saquon. With, you'll take a shot with me at the end of the workout? I don't trust you when you're drunk. What do you mean you don't trust me? Mr. Five shot. Finger <laughs> <laughs> Manipulator. You wish. Keep making shit up for these people to troll me with, you fucking asshole. <laughs> I see some leather back there. There's Get the no camera. Leather. I see There's some leather. leather. There's no leather. Here's leather some leather. It's just a belt, Lenny, and it's not even leather. That's not leather? That looks pretty... Here, who wants to hold on to this? Thanks a lot, Barkley. It's really nice. So now you have two fucking cameras, Leonard? Yeah, I can't wait. I'm going to get started. Two cameras that are just going to collect dust. Basically. Now. No? You're going to learn how to use them? I'm going to have to. If you can look up all that tranny porn and all that other sick shit you look up. looking up. You can, like you can figure out <laughs> Have you seen my camera. phone history? Huh? Have you seen my phone history? Yeah, every time you turn your phone on, all it says it has that little bug on it with virus, virus, virus. What does it do? The virus cleaner? He's got an automatic <laughs> virus cleaner on there. <laughs> well, thanks again. It's going to be put to good use. I'm getting everything started up. And that whiskey's going to be put to good use, too. Good morning. What the hell is that? That's what happens when you don't wash yourself. No, I wash right? myself very... You scrub, you scrub yes, your feet? Yes, I do. That's why I'm shocked with what the hell this thing is. You get fucking gangrene. And I don't even, I don't wear uh, shoes anymore. Work. I mean, if, when I was working this, I didn't have this. And, uh, Leonard, you don't, you do not bathe properly. Yes, I do. No, if you did, you, your feet would not look like that. No, I've taken a scrub with yes. that. No, that's what we're, I'm, I'm you asking you. That, you scrub that? Yes, and, I, and, and yes, I got this. I sprayed some uh, antifungal on it yesterday, but I'm going to do that every night. Does it itch or burn or anything? No, but I don't understand why I do because I have a scrub brush you know, with my you antibacterial soap. You don't understand why. Look at the inside of your house. I'm There's sandals on, doesn't, Brad. It doesn't matter. You're filthy. You're a filthy person. What? You are. That's no, just not a very scientific answer. But it makes sense. Well, Mark. what was the question? Why is this what, is, what is this on my feet? Oh, maybe if you go to a <laughs> doctor once in a while. Dr. Bard Schittler? <laughs> Bard Schittler at your, podiatry. Exactly. Go to your podiatrist. I don't but, know. You can see when money goes to the doctor. No, I don't know what they're I think it may have about. something to do with, uh, no. like some, maybe a diabetic type of, uh, Why don't we get on the gym's PA system and ask if there's a podiatrist or doctor and we can <laughs> call him over, call him over to the squat rack and have him look at it. That's what you're squatting today? Huh. Yes. Huh. What is that? I'm squatting the equivalent of certain someone who remained nameless. 330 pounder? We'll see. What the hell was that? Is first, first cigarettes. 
I use them when I deadlift. Because you got weak bitch hands. Join the club, pal. <laughs> it's hard to hold that weight to do reps. No, plus my hands fucking sweat, so and they don't have chalk here. Your hands sweat. Well, I'm working out, yeah. It's impossible. You don't got to sweat. You mean your palms have never sweat before? What, what do you mean? What's yes, they have what's so pulls. out of the? You were doing the rack pulls in your backyard. Remember, your hands were slipping. No, off. it was the sweat rolling down from my arms. Right. Well, we, we sweat. Again, you're so generalistic. You cannot never be specific, can you? No wonder why you got so many issues. Got to be specific. <laughs> yeah. I have so yeah. many issues. Thanks, pal. You're, thinking, you're basically saying your hands are sweating from your palms, but then the pain, they're swirling down whatever. from your arms. I mean, it's not so whatever. Okay. You got to get a little more specific there. I'll go there. take a shit, and I'll be ready. You sure that's all your problem I'll is? Say, I'll save it for you. What, you want to be my human toilet? Come in here. <laughs> Listen to, to this. I want you to replace that toilet with your Hey, bed. this isn't, we're not one of those leather bars that you frequent, <laughs> and you run the show at, from what I hear. Yeah, you heard that, huh? You run the show, I told basically. I not to tell anybody. Well, the word's out. I keep finding out about all this stuff. Look at all the you're men's just, bathroom you're walls. Just, you're stalking me, aren't you? Leather daddy, Instagram name. <laughs> I might have to change it to that. <laughs> I think it's already been changed. <laughs> I think you've got it for life. If I need oxygen, I'm going to suck it out of some nice, thick, round ass. Where's your, where's your oxygen deprivation mask? <laughs> oh, yeah. oh yeah, yeah, yeah. It's down on Broward Boulevard. Yeah, that's, right. that's where it is. Yeah, I, I told her I, I can't come down right now. I don't want to pass Here. out. There. Pass out from what? The trip down there or the experience itself? The experience, yeah, I said, have my Why would you pass body. out? I said that you're going to have... Do you want to Do you want to pass out or you don't want to pass out? Well, I do. I, just, I told her you want a dead body on your hands. She goes, well, you always keep telling me to kill you. <laughs> kill me, Connor. So I figured he didn't mind. It's just a great feeling. I encourage everyone to tell a girl to kill you. And, while having sex or whatever, and then just the thought of her possibly doing it, it's a real turn on. <laughs> I would suggest everyone try it. So remember that video clip you posted of yourself squatting 405? Yeah. Did you read Jay's comment, his input? Yeah, I should go back to doing 135. 10, 10 sets, sets of 10, 10 at 135 to perfect, perfect your depth. Yeah. What do you think about that? I'll try it. I'll try anything. I take Jay. Jay's an asshole, but he, he does know his shit. I'll listen to Jay when it comes to that stuff. For sure. Give it a shot. I think... I probably could have gotten lower if I had a spot. You went pretty low. I mean, I went. I wasn't. Ex I watched that clip. I wasn't expecting you to get that yeah. low. I felt good. That's the first time I attempted. So it's good, man. Yeah. We'll see. At least one of us is making some as gains. Long as, as long as my hernia doesn't burst out, I'm good. And it's been. It happened two weeks ago when well, I was. If it does, there. make sure I'm filming. Yeah. <laughs> so what pre-workout did you give? Actually, Brad? the strongest one I had, the one given to me by Dale Chance, Dope Labs. Uh, pre workout. Dope shit your pants labs. Nah, you're alright. Yeah. That stuff kicks you up, right? No, yeah, no, it's good. It's all right. I don't, it doesn't have that. What, what did you say? That, is your nose Tingling. bleeding? Yeah. What in the fuck? Did yeah. you get that already? I. Dude, that's a sign from those things. I think you said that's a sign also, you stop fucking taking yeah, it. Also, it makes your mouth dry. Kind of what I told them. It's more about my back. It sort of popped on the bottom right hand side and more about my knees, too. All right, so I gotta do another set there, but yeah, I gotta. Whatever you're I may dump the bar. Yeah. Whatever you're experimenting with, you, you can end it. Well, he was telling me he doesn't feel well taking it. You might want to stop taking it. 
does it take shit to make you feel better? Yeah, good? but I mean, if, after 30 days, if I can tolerate it, it gets better. My theory is there'll be some more muscle growth from either how, many eat, how many days have you been taking? Since February 1st, and I noticed that thirst and dry mouth four immediately. Day, four days? Yes, I noticed that thirst immediately. Goodbye. Stream thirst. <laughs> yeah, you might want to dump that, Leonard. Don't worry about my low back. I'm right, right side, right side of my low back. You feel it squatting? Yeah, when I went down my first rep. Fuck. I gotta do another set though. It's gonna fucking. I gotta well, contest. Why would you do anything that makes sense, right? Well, so keep taking it. Take it's not more so much sense. But is it doing what it's supposed to do? Yeah, be careful. I may have to dump this bar if my back goes out. Serious? So it's gonna squash in. Man. Yeah, just sort of watch your step up. Will do. Okay. Stay up right Thighs are looking big and pumped. Cross striations at 330 pounds. You know any other 330 pounders with cross striations there, Brad? Well, thanks. That's a compliment. You're not going to start gushing blood out of your nose, are you? Uh, maybe. I'll just walk over to Brad and give him a yeah. little a little rain shower. He'll look like the girl in the movie Carrie. Oh, it's Sissy Spacek. Yeah. His face is already red over there. He'll be the doing. sissy leather daddy. <laughs> Come on, leather daddy. Show us how you pick up those 400 pound big gay bears off the floor and slam them naked. Stick your hand right in there naked and slam them. That's what that strength's for. Brad, I think you got your, your calling right now. He turned his back on you. You need a spot? No, I need a, I need a fucking dry back. Brad, I wouldn't stand there. It's, a little back, I, I gotta keep it out of it. It's not a good You're deal. You're 315, it's not even your body weight. Yeah, but he said it, he might have to throw it down because of his lower back if it goes out. Uh, you want a belt? No. Oh, you don't have, no belts will fit around that fucking disgusting stomach. Come on, you got it. Easy little warm up. Yeah, that commercial was that was the only decent yeah. one. But, but horrendous cookie cutter. The game sucked, the commercial sucked. What'd you think of Adam Levine at halftime? I think he kind of looked like Brad if Brad would have got his beard oh, a little tighter. Oh my You're looking God. at Brad right there. Oh my God. Actually, I like the fact that he donated his money to the boys and girls clubs. You don't see those other type of crap donate money, do you? No, never. What about Chris Long? He, he got an award at the beginning of the game. For what? For donating his game checks to, where did he donate it again? I don't remember, but I know what you're talking to about. Some, yeah, Chris Long did. To some ridiculous organization that causes more trouble than it's worth. <laughs> Chris Long, I've said it before, you're nothing but a, a kiss ass. Well, he can do that because daddy's got That's Howie money. Long's son, right? Yeah. yeah. So he does of course, yeah, exactly. That's why he can do Howie that. Howie Long's son, who's Rob Halpern's sex god. From Judas Priest. <laughs> Brad Levine, here he is. <laughs> Just trim it up here, Brad. You're the spitting image. I yeah, swear okay, to God. Okay. You are a little heavily more muscled than him. He's a little on the slight side. <laughs> but why is he allowed to show his tits? <laughs> and not Janet Jackson? Right. Why do you think, Brother? I don't know. We talk about it all the time. It makes no sense to me. <laughs> Brad Levine. <laughs> The leather daddy, uh, a, a woman's, Brad Levine. A woman's, a woman's tit is more offensive than a, than a man's, for whatever reason. So other countries, they don't, they wouldn't bat an eye at that shit. Nude beaches, all that shit. They don't fucking. Yep. Here, everything's got to be, you know, got to be careful. Well, they they were complaining too because during the halftime show, that rapper Ooh. came out Ooh. and was 
you, you could tell they were bleeping shit out. It was yeah, it was on a time delay. Because they were cursing. So they got mad of all the profanity. I don't blame them. Why those idiots come out in that, in that fucking Cadillac? Somebody, that was a disgrace. He gets paid money to go out like that? So you watched it. I did. So I, I can't help but want not watch what the cookie cutters are up to. I mean, it just gets worse and worse. Leonard told me I should get a Julian Edelman jersey now. Yeah. He really likes that kid. I always did. So basically, people spend $3,000 if you're a Rams fan to go to the Super Bowl. All they got was a Maroon 5 concert and a field goal. Yeah. <laughs> Pretty much. Very odd. What can we call Brad's with it? Oh Delray 5 God. or something? Oh my God. Every <laughs> Trim up that beard, I swear to God, you'd be a lookalike. Just fucking go do your workout, you asshole. You're worse than fucking Jason. You're making up your stupid shit. Here come the memes of, of you yeah, on the stage at Super Bowl halftime. Here we go. Yep. Perfect. Just trim up the beard. That's all it takes. You don't share, do you? I shared my pre-workout. The least thing you could do is share some of your you-know-what. I have a I have a joint I have a joint rolled up for you in the car, Leonard. Oh, oh joints or beer? Share. Don't forget the bottle of whiskey. Yeah, yeah joints or alcohol. I told you I'd share the he wants me in an early grave, doesn't he? Look who's talking, asshole. Who fucking overdoses on GHB and ecstasy and ends up in the hospital and Baker acted? But you're making fun of me for drinking alcohol? No, I'm just saying. Uh, you're a boozer and a smoker. That's a fact. And you look like Adam Levine. <laughs> Which you probably should be proud of because the girls were swooning over him. His the emaciated body. Who? Oh, Levine? The chocolate golem. You know who Gollum is? No. You ever see the you never saw Lord of the Rings? Yes. The Gollum, the little creepy guy with the big fucking oh, eyes. That's what and they the call fucked him. up hair. That's what they call yeah, you. A, chocolate Gollum. He is so emaciated. He looks horrible. Our church. Because you gotta suffer in here. Okay. And you gotta push. And what you're doing is inspiring other people to do it too. Get in there and push yourself to the limit because there's times when, hey, get under a squat rake. I've said a few prayers in my life, believe me. Please don't have tear everything to shmitherines. So this is a church. Say it's not a library. I don't like everybody sitting in there and with all gussied up in their church clothes and sitting on their ass. And some people don't even want to kneel down anymore. We know you like kneeling down. <laughs> kill me, Actually, I don't. Kill me, got it. I, uh, yeah. I'm laying down, I'm smothered. I'm I, don't, I don't know how you guys train in here at this time. Literally every single piece of equipment has someone on it. Twice a week, that's about it. Just two days a week you two come? Yeah, something like that. There's not one free machine. Be it free weights. The mornings I don't feel like getting up, I end up here in the afternoon with this gorilla. You don't go to Delray much? Weren't you there the other day? I was there the other day, yeah. Whatever I feel like doing. Speaking of gorillas. Whoa, he's getting bigger. Man, big and harder. Have you taken that fucking bandana off? I like the bandana. I, I know that. I asked you a question. Are you taking it off yet? No. What is wrong with you? He looks <laughs> like he just did a fucking eight ball. He looks great. His teeth are going. Look. He's bigger and harder though. Yeah, I like. I like. It. He's always possible. I'm just telling the truth. Oh. Yeah. Bigger. Look at him. Right. Monster. Yeah. I think I'm phenomenal genetics. You dwarf everybody. Yeah, I do. I dwarf. Fucking dwarf. <laughs> dwarf. <laughs> delusional number one and delusional number two. <laughs> What? Hey, the non cookie cutter with that there, Dan. You don't see anybody having them. Yeah, nobody. Maybe in the 90s. Maybe in the 90s, way back in the day. It's like Tupac. <laughs> Tupac or no. Uh... Jason, the maniacs and piss troopers need to know when are you going to bring Cynthia on the podcast? I have to ask her. She works a lot of jobs, man. I have to ask her. 
them up to her, not up to me. It's up to her. She works a lot of jobs. She works jobs seven work? jobs. Her ass. Seven, seven jobs. Seven yeah, jobs. Seven jobs. Yeah, really. I'm not lying. What? Are, name three of them. She owns her. her she works for. Her, she works her company. She does art. She does art. One. She does Kava I've seen bar. Some of her art. Yeah, one, yeah. One. I have two. One. No, she does art like paintings and stuff. She sells them. One on Kava bar. Two. She runs a run, works at a doctor and she does massage therapy. She's busy. Okay. And then she does other things on the side. We promise to be completely respectful she comes on the podcast right Leonard yeah, but she, I tell you what that's the kind of girl you wouldn't want to disrespect her so can't hit you upside the head yeah but I don't think she has time right now she I she's got a lot of shit going on and she got a sick mom with heart problems she's taking care of her mom is your mom down here yeah very sick very sick girl not her last that's not good so she's got a lot of shit going on unfortunately not a good time right now she's got time to go to the arcade with you because she likes me that's why there's well, a reason for tell, why. Tell her you want her to meet your friends. I'll try. Sweetheart, why don't you come meet some of my friends? I'll try. I'll try. I can't. Pro I can't. I can't. You've met her friends, right? I can't for force. Well, all her friends are the comma people. I'm trying to get him to get Cynthia on the podcast. I'm still a freak. I'm still a freak. I'm loose in the gym. Yeah. Like a, like a foghorn. Yeah. Tears. <laughs> it sounds like a beep beep on crack. Who cares? <laughs> Who gives a fuck? The fox will tell you that. Who gives a fuck? Your forearms and calves are disgusting. <laughs> Look at all that muscle. That's sick. Too bad none of that size went to his dick. <laughs> okay, Jason, we, I think we get it. You don't care. Who gives a fuck? I, I kind of missed the eat crow line. You should go back to that. Eat crow. At least rotate them. Are we doing the podcast with her this week? No, she can't. She's what? working till 8 or 9 o'clock at the doctor's office. Every day? She works six days a week, bro. She's hard, bro. She don't work not off much. Girl works hard like me all the time. Like me. Wait, 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 wait. What? Goes, you work hard? And in certain ways. How many days a week do you work? <laughs> no, 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 no. Wandering around aimlessly all day. Working on <laughs> Jason. Shut up, yeah. shut up, Jason. <laughs> I never, you shut up too. I never saw that close. No, I never saw anything like that. <laughs> Who gives a fuck? Said that <laughs> Jesus Christ, Jason. There, there's your first ringtone. Aren't you getting a bunch of ringtones? Yeah, there's your first this. one. They put it on. Could you there. imagine every time your phone rings? <laughs> Who cares? Who gives a fuck? I, Who gives a fuck? I, I, I throw my phone in the intercoastal. <laughs> <laughs> Who gives a dip shit? <laughs> we'll save that eat crow shirt for Dale Chance. She can have it. Eat Not your crow, it. baby. Eat, eat, eat manure. <laughs> <laughs> He'll be resorting to eating crow once that hunting gets dried up up there. These first kids get a slice of humble pie. That's my gift for my hard work, so nice Lexus. It's a, it's a Japanese car. That's what Brad drives. He told me he just paid it off. He could have it 20 or more years. Easily. That's Toyota. I buy used Lexus. I, it's luxury and it's still Japanese and it will run forever because it's Japanese. It's something I want You wanted. can probably drive a Lexus till the wheels fall off. Yeah, basically. They can go 300,000 miles. I know they're luxury cars, but they're still very, very economical type of luxury car and very affordable. Mm -hmm. I get that. That's my gift. <laughs> You're entitled. I'm entitled. You're entitled. I'm entitled. You're entitled to treat yourself. <laughs> it's a Christmas gift, the yeah. end of the year. Chihuahua. Isn't your birthday coming up? Yes. When's your birthday? The 22nd. You hear that, Manix? There better be a lot of packages being sent to the post office box for the Misfits for Jason's birthday. Yeah, February 22nd. Big Lenny said do yeah, it. More, more uh, stuffed toy cucumbers. All that outstanding mints. More toy cucumbers, please. Oh, guess what? Me and what? <laughs> Cynthia has a surprise for me. She's taking me somewhere for my birthday. Really? Yes. Not gonna announce you don't that. want to tell me on camera? I'll tell you off camera. 
You're gonna film it for the maniacs, at least some of yeah, it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, take it off, take it she's off. Take it, she's taking you straight to Piss City. No, tell you, take it off camera. <laughs> take it off camera, take it off camera. I wanna, ah, this is interesting. I, I, wanna, I wanna see where this conversation's going on camera. I wanna take it off camera. So awesome. Cynthia is doing something special for your birthday. Not an ounce on she, I'm not. We're not going to announce where, but she's doing something special for your birthday. Yes. Does it involve any bodily fluids? That's private. That's between... Oh, so it, So the answer could be yes. Maybe. See, Lenny? Yeah. Maybe. Keep it low profile. Profile. Yeah. I liked Lenny's idea earlier. What were you saying before that Jason should do a threesome with Cynthia and J-Star? Out. Come on, Jason. No, 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 no. Jason, be, you're not getting good. into the spirit of this, Jason. Hell fucking no. That'd be hot. I, I tell you what. You can think it's hot all you want. She doesn't live here anymore. She lives in Atlanta. Can you, can you J Star moved to Atlanta? Yes, she doesn't live here. That's the hot there. I gotta get up there. Yeah. There's, there's clubs like the Las Vegas Lounge, like dozens of them. May I talk to you in private? Yes, Jason, Please. you can talk yeah, to me in but private. By the time I get back on, I'll re my muscle receptors will kick and I'll get a bigger strength gain, I'll get bigger and freakier. I'll blow up like a fucking balloon on cloud nine. <laughs> a balloon? <laughs> a balloon on cloud nine. Yeah. Right. In other words, a Dale Chance, a Chance of State. He's like a balloon. Dale, on the look, Dale looks like a freaking pansy right now. A, <laughs> a small twerp on twerp chickmunk. <laughs> he looks like a fat chickmunk with those cheeks. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that, that is true. Goddamn, Dale, where the hell have you gone to shit? <laughs> It's called recovering from a car accident, Who Jason. Who gives a fuck? You look like a pile, you look like a pile of shit, right? 50% body fat. You, you know how you always like to say you're in car accidents? Yeah. He actually was in one. A really bad one. Yeah. He, he almost died, I heard. He, and it, if he wasn't as muscular as he is, he probably would have. He would have been mangled like a pancake. <laughs> probably has his size to thank. <laughs> yeah, size saved him, luckily. But now he looks like a... A bug. <laughs> a little ant. He looks like a little ant. You guys shrank. Ant-Man's ant. <laughs> a little ant. He shrank down. The North Carolina vagina. He, he shrank like a pea. He shrank like a, he went from a, a raisin to a pea. <laughs> he shrank. He's so small. I'll dwarf him. I'll make him look like a pipsqueak. <laughs> Me and Lenny will whoop hey. his ass. Challenge issue to Dale. <laughs> Ch you can't even show. He looks like crap right now. Jesus. <laughs> he looks like a pile of <laughs> a pile of dog shit. You know what? You know what Dale is saying right now? <laughs> He's saying, "Who cares?" <laughs> he doesn't care. He doesn't care about com competing anymore. Actually, you have to say, "Who cares?" with a southern accent. He's retired. He's retired <laughs> from fitness. How would Dale Chan say, "Who cares?" Who cares? <laughs> oh my God, that was good. Oh, he's all right. retired from fitness. He'll never come back. His days are over. How many times have you said that in the my past? My days are over, but his days are more than over. He's decrepit. <laughs> <laughs> he's a mule. <laughs> all right. You guys all done? Yeah. I'm starving. I gotta get dinner. Are you taking him home? Yep. All right. Look, I'll show you this. Just let me show you this. Off, off, off. off camera. Off camera. Off camera, bro. Off camera, bro. Off camera. Off camera.